Hi guys, welcome back. My name is Della, also known as Natural Garden Girl. And today I have a very big smile on my face for a strange reason actually, because I'm actually really frustrated. <laughs> but I'm smiling anyway. So today I was meant to do a shoot somewhere and it didn't quite go according to plan. So I feel like I've kind of wasted my day, but I refuse to let that disturb me. So um, I decided to vlog and I decided to show you guys what I'm going to be up to. So today, I thought it'd be a good idea to do a video where I kind of show you some of the things that you can pick up on the street to eat because I find that if you don't know what to eat right you can end up spending a lot of money I'm on the road quite a lot and so sometimes you know like you need to have snacks and stuff to just kind of keep you going so I thought I'd take you guys along and let's try out some snacks okay um, yeah so yeah this is a very impromptu vlog this is definitely not planned but it's one that we're gonna do together okay yeah so it's um been an interesting day so far guys it really has um yeah i was really frustrated and so i'm smiling from ear to ear because i just want to be happy so i'm choosing happiness over frustration in fact a little while ago someone actually did a video on me where like a video that i did like years ago and they did a video on me saying that they thought i had mental problems because i was ranting about <laughs> i was ranting about something that i was frustrated with so now when i do rant i smile with my rants so that you guys know that you know it's not that serious it's not that deep but yeah here we go so i'm in the car at the moment i'm actually in an uber um i've got some water with me which i carry in my bottle here to keep it nice and cold because right now it is seriously hot out there okay like really really hot so let's go look for some snacks shall we some of you may have noticed but maybe not all of you right i had my eyebrows done so i had the micro shaded or bladed or whatever it's called man it hurt like hell i'm telling you like she started doing it and i guess it's like a tattoo right she started doing it and like water was leaking from my eyes because it was so painful she put numbing cream on it but after she was a certain place i was like this is just too much it was so painful but obviously you can't stop you can't leave one eyebrow right so i had to grin and bear the pain and so she did one and then she and then she was moving on to the next one and i was like oh thank god you finished she was like no no, no we go over it three times so the pain that i endured having my eyebrows done but actually today I'm really happy that I've had them done. They're still a little bit swollen right now and they look a little bit dark because when you get them done, you have to, they have to scab and then they fall off and then you get the, like, the actual natural colour. So they will look a little bit more natural but actually yesterday I was really paranoid about them. I was like, what have I done? This looks awful. But actually today I feel a bit better about them. So yeah, this is what I've done. It, I, think it, I think the lady's done a pretty good job. I think I'm happy with it. Um, so I'm still getting used to my new face. But I think it's all good, guys. What do you think? Let me know in the comment section. Or do you think I look weird and I've made a big mistake? Let me know anyway. I can take it, the mistake. So I've just come to this amazing place. They do like kaklo, um, kelewele. You know plantain is my thing. If you know anything about me, if you don't know anything about me, the one thing you need to know about me is that I am a plantain addict. I will eat plantain in all different types of forms, all different concoctions, all different ways I will eat it. I love plantain so much. In fact, let me just tell you a very quick story, right? When I was, um, <clears throat> you know, a little bit of a cheat, what I used to do, I used to like, when we, people come to my house for dinner, right? And then we'll be like, oh, let's split the plantain. I would hide my plantain underneath my rice so I have extra above everybody else because I just didn't want to share. So I used to cheat like that. That's what I used to do. But I'm going to grab some of uh, the keloele and the kaklo as well because I like both and I can't decide. So I'm going to have some of both. Um, and I love the way that they fry it here because this is the original way to do. This is the way that gets in all the flavors. And so it's so authentic. I love it. So I'm going to go get me some now. I'm salivating even, oh my gosh.
those of you that don't know what kaklo is, kaklo is when the plantain is starting to get very ripe and it's very old, like black on the outside, they smash it, they add flour, ginger, onions, and I think you can put a little bit of spice in it as well. And then it makes into like a fritter almost, if you know what fritters is, right? It makes into like a fritter and then they fry it. It's really, really nice. And you can put pepper in it as well. This one's not too peppery, it's perfect actually. If you don't really like pepper, this one's really great. So you can kind of see like the texture of it. So it's just like exactly like you would expect a fritter to be. It's like that. That's really nice. Oh, try it. Next time you're here, I'm in the airport. Stop by here and try it. Yeah, I'm talking about mouthful. Mm -hmm. Yes, he's got some kelly -wele. Okay, hold on. You guys can have a little peek, okay? If I drop this right now, I'm actually going to cry like real tears, real ones. Look at that. Piping hot. It's hot. Oh my God. Okay, let me try one. I can't wait anymore. Don't anyone talk to me. I'm busy, fully engaged right now. This is the real stuff. Mm. It's good, guys. It's really good. So I have my sugar cane here. I haven't had sugar cane in a long time. Yeah, these guys are going to surround the car. It's normal, guys. Don't worry. It's been a while. So here we go. I can't remember how to eat this, so don't laugh at me, okay? Mm. This is always better when once it's been out of the fridge because then it's cold and it's really, really nice. Oh, God. No problem is you have to know where to spit, bro. Thankfully, I have a bag here, so. I'm oh, going just put it here and I can just eat it. I'm going to put the rest in the fridge when I get home because it's actually really, really nice. Mm. Mm. And it's so convenient that they chop it up for you. So they take off the outside and they chop it up through small so you can just eat like this. So it's actually quite refreshing when you're on the move to eat stuff like this. Mm. Mm. And don't none of you be telling me that, oh, I don't have to eat sugar cane properly. This is how I eat it. This is how natural garlic girl eats sugar cane, okay? I'm not you, this is me. You know me, I have my quirky ways. This is one of them. Mm -hmm. Wow. There you go, guys. Back at home now. I actually really wanted to um, get some more things to eat, but the, t the time is just going, like the day to day has just run really, really fast. It's gone away. So I am back at home, so I'm going to end it right there. But hopefully I will get to show you guys more stuff in the coming days, weeks or whatever. Um, I really want to explore some more food stuff. I know you guys know that I'm very fussy, but I'm still going to do it for you guys, okay? I'm still going to try some stuff. I'm going to explain it to you and all of that. So watch this space, it's going to happen, okay? But that is the end of today's video. I hope you have enjoyed it. If you haven't already subscribed to this channel, please do me a favor, hit the subscribe button and the notification bell. Don't forget to also like, comment and share. Until next time, I am out. Nuti Fafa.